As a landlord and as a property investor, I personally believe that you should always provide the best possible housing for prospective tenants or for your tenants. With that said, I don't get people off the internet who will complain that landlords don't, pre don't provide good housing for their tenants. And then by the same, in the same breath, when a tenant leaves a property, trashes the property and leaves it in a mess like this one has, in the same breath, they would then say, oh, well, that's nothing. That's the cost of doing business. Oh, that doesn't cost a lot. You need to spend, what, uh, just get a cleaner in. You can't just get a cleaner in. As an example, the tenants have put holes, put nails throughout the house, and we're talking about everywhere. That is not cheap to make right. What you have to do is remove all the nails, fill it, and repaint. You can't just repaint all the nails. You have to repaint the whole wall. I would not give a new tenant a wall like that. And that costs a lot to make right. As an example, this bedroom, that color is wild. You cannot give a new tenant, hand over a property like this, a room like this to a new tenant. That is gonna take a lot of paint and a lot of manpower, man hours, to make right. And that's not cheap. So when I, when I quote, when I say, okay, yeah, this is gonna cost about X amount of money, or this needs a reverb. That's because that's how much it really costs to do stuff like that. And you can't just comment after looking at a grainy video on the internet and say, oh yeah, that just needs a quick cleanup, or oh, that would cost like 50 quid. This reverb, the reverb for this property, I'm gonna do a quick walk around, just so you can see. In my estimation, it's gonna cost between 10, 15, 15 grand and the extra money it just depends on whether it needs a full rewire or not but if you look at this this is going to cost at least 10 grand probably more towards the 15 I would expect but then you got people on the internet saying oh no it's not that's just that's nothing that's just like clean it down remove the rubbish and you get a new tenant I would be horrified I would be ashamed to hand this property over to a new tenant in this state. You, you just can't have it two ways. You can't complain that landlords are providing shoddy properties and then in the same breath say, oh well yeah, don't spend any money to do this property up and, and make it right. That's just crazy. Anyway, uh, yeah.